survived. That was so scary, man. Things this man makes me do. <laughs> These desserts. How can you not come here, guys? Mark Wayne's was just here. Morning, what's up guys and welcome to today's vlog To be honest, I think this might be the first official one because I've tried doing Many others before but I'm gonna try on this trip to be more consistent with vlogging It's my birthday weekend and we are going to Great Ocean Road Apollo Bay for the weekend. So come with us just packing some essential um, breakfast lunch and dinner for us to cook so that we're not just like eating out uh, currently packing my first box so this is the veggies i've got capsicum uh, zucchini what's this uh, mushroom asparagus tomato um, Bocconcini, avocado, um, and then I've got a butternut pumpkin there, some eggs, cheese, then in here it's stuff for like um, the cheese platter and cooking. So I'll put some olive oil in this old mason jar, mix some garlic and ginger, uh, and stuff for the cheese platter. Then we've got some bacon for breakfast, this stuff cabana that for the cheese platter. Um, and then I've got some free ranged, sorry, uh, butterfly chicken, some beef lasagna, apparently it's really good, it's from Aldi. And some salmon. Um, and then just in here, we've got like some snacks and stuff and um, someone thinks he's still in. <laughs> Still in primary school, so it's essential that he packs that. So yeah, just gonna pack this up. Just trying not to eat out too much, um, and my chicken breast there. Right, this is what we have, and I'm just gonna put these three things in a bag as well. We are finally on our way. Just need to make two more pit stops to Super Cheap Auto and to Woolworths before we head to Great Ocean Road. Driver, say hi. <laughs> we just are here to get some diesel top-up oil because the car needs a service soon and we're going on a long road trip. Well, not really that long, two, three hours. And just in case, just for good measure. What does that do? Get oh, if you get so bogged. How much are they? 320. I want it to be unsweetened. just four dollars eighty before as I try to walk past but I want to try these so she's coming forgot one more thing now we are finally done I will never get over the rising cost of living it's just absolutely ridiculous I know it's only gonna get worse but like it's crazy like things are jumping by dollars not even cents like they used to be no these are dollars like and like some things are like two three dollars difference from just like last week welcome to the new norm we're going up a mountain right now and it is raining the roads are slippery do great ocean work road on the way back so we were supposed to take the Great Ocean Road, but 
Okay. Somebody to didn't get the memo. Day, Try and do Great Ocean Road quite often. I, the last time we were there though was about three months ago. But I'd say we go at least five times a year. Yeah, five to seven times a year we do Great Ocean Road. Alright, so we just arrived. It's right opposite the ocean. I'm um, just going up. All right, we just got here to our cabin and it's so cute. They've got that jumping thing there, <laughs> jumping castle. And the view of the ocean, they've got the pool down there. Um, it's called the jump pad. And so we'll just go in. Very basic cabin. You've got your amenities, the fridge, oven, two bedrooms. So it's sleep six, separate toilet and bathroom, which is good for me. Um, so cute. And so our car is just parked right next door. Yeah, wish it was a sunnier day but it is what it is I'm grateful and blessed to have made it to 31 years 31 years <laughs> we're at the taste of the region um, yeah liquor store and it's right at the back of the brewery Got these all these different chutneys. Oh, they've got Otway chutneys, zucchini chutneys. Oh my gosh! Uh, mate, we said ten pack, didn't we? Wipes in the game are these $2.99 Audi wipes I get from um, Audi. Um, they're just the best quality, even compared to all the branded ones. Yes. Uh, salmon. I actually taste one now. Oh mate, this is so good. Sweet potato, but I can't be bothered. Cheers! Favorite cuisine? Uh, he was, uh, yeah, because it was his father's before he passed away. Um, is it still open? I don't know, I don't think so. But he, taught, he tells me. Uh, <laughs> describe it, describe it. The flavor of the avocado with the chicken. Mm. I can taste everything. Mm -hmm. Even look. You see this? Oh, look at all that money now. Mm. Righto. Uh, I've been wanting to try these for some time. So I'm going to finally try them. 
chicken is freaking awesome. Mm. Oh, that is a fold. I actually thought it was bigger than that. Uh. <laughs> I thought it was like a wagon wheel size. And I was like, oh, uh, 120 calories for one and it's like a wagon wheel size. But no, then little snack sizes. Wait, let me just, let me just wash my palette. This is what she looks like. She's like perfect. She tastes like a nopper, but more chocolatey. Are they noppers? Noppers. You can get them from like Audi and Woolies and that. So decadent. Creamy, chocolatey, perfect amount of crunch, hazelnut tea. Yum, how can you stop at one? 10 out of 10. I think it was like four dollars ninety. baby eczema cream one and I like it it's light and it's just for that extra protection for dry skin during the winter morning this is how she's looking this morning it was very windy last night, but it was beautiful hearing the waves crash as we went to sleep. All these small little shops. And what I love is the backdrop, you can't see it because it's raining, like it's cloudy, it's overcast. But the backdrop of this town is um, mountains. And then it's beach right in front of them how beautiful is that a big fan of mark wings on youtube he is a food vlogger guys he came to great ocean road like a month ago all right so it's a shame that the cafe is really packed so i just ordered a smoothie but you guys i love this cafe it's like the first one that has like real whole food uh, recipes, no added sugars or unnecessary processed carbs. So I got some snacks. I got a mango chia pudding, a Snickers bar that they made. And I ordered um, like a breakfast smoothie. I'm gonna taste this while we wait. I think it's sweetened with like prunes. That's really nice. I can see that it has a lot of like nuts in there. The crust is probably almond flour mixed with some like real butter. And this is probably cacao nibs mixed with like some really simple basic basic eggs, Benny. So 
say. I forgot to tell him that he doesn't like his eggs. Um, what do they call it? The sunny side up. And it comes with one toast. And but he's all, you're alright with that, eh? <coughs> Very simple, very very simple, very basic. Then you come here, but I recommend. So we've just driven out at one of the lookouts, but it's pouring rain. But poor Saya really wanted to go see, so he's committed to it. So he's just outside having a look um, at the view. And I've just remembered, I've got my chia seed pudding that I haven't tasted. So this is a mango one. Coconut yogurt. Not, not sweet at all. Because obviously they didn't add any sweetness to it. Let me taste it on its own. Can't really taste the mango much, but it's all right. It's something that could easily make at home. This is definitely too much cheer for one sitting, I reckon. Sometimes it can be hard to digest for some people. All right, we are here at the lighthouse at the Otways. Uh, we've been here once before, but we didn't actually go inside. We were in a bit of a rush to head back home. Entrance. The Light Keepers Cafe. Um, there's the light station. All right, passing residential. There's the Light Keepers Cafe here, and then the lighthouse walk down there. How beautiful and blue the ocean is. Oh, how are you feeling? Yeah, good. My phone almost took off. Really? Because of the wind? <laughs> yeah, nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> we survived. That was so scary, man. That was scary. All right, guys, so we are back at the fish and chip co-op and this is their view. It's absolutely beautiful. All right, so we've just reached Sabine Falls. <laughs> it's quite a track though. Um, there's no service, so we have no idea whether there's another Oh no, you're right, 2.5 hours. So, viewing platform 3 to 6 kilometers return, 2.5 to 5, 2.5 hours, moderate to steep walk. Um, very, very rainy. Not gonna lie. Um, okay, so it's just past 3 p.m. and I was just telling Saya, like, you know, if it was like morning, it would be fine, but it's two and a half hours return and we're up on a mountain it's about a 25 minute drive up and down the mountain and there's no lights there's no like barricades to keep you safe um so it's quite risky so we're like you know what we already drove here let's just try and do the trek about half an hour into it um if we don't see a waterfall that's fine we'll just head back very, very rainforesty. <laughs> very, I'll show you. Whoop! Honestly, lush, definitely lush. What's in these bushes? We don't know. It's Australia. Spiders, snakes, everything, you name it. The things this man makes me do. Oh. <sighs> 
we are far, far up the mountain right now. Right in his element. It's not even a proper trek. So we try to go to two waterfalls today. Usually it's pretty easy to, sorry, just opening the car, to get um, into the waterfalls. But given the weather, the main ones are, the roads to it are closed. So this is the second one we try to go to, but it's gonna get dark very, very soon, quite quickly. So I was like, you know what, it's, let's just head back and um, we see waterfalls all the time. So hopefully on our next trip, but for now, somebody's beeping, rude. We are gonna head back to the hotel. Oh, Pretty. I meant to go to the pub at the brewery for dinner tonight, but we'll see. Do you feel like going or no? Do you want to stay indoors? I just love these pickled onions. Love, 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 love. Two cabanas. Let's go. Let's go. Lasagna. <coughs> Just a quiet night in watching movies. Record and hasn't seen Paul Gate yet. It's true, I haven't even brushed my teeth. Oh, look at him hard at work. All packed and ready to check out. Mate here has been busy cleaning all morning and packing the car. Yay! What are you wearing? <laughs> These ones. Alright, we'll see you at the next stop. How beautiful is this beach? There's so many pockets and beaches around. So we've just arrived at Mariner's Lookout. How cute is this by the locals? It's like a little cottage there. Show you. Guys, I'm trying to slow down my um my filming because my little sister, she's a graphic designer, so she's always telling me, so slow it down. It's an easy walk, I think. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Watch where you step. Almost there. Honestly, this is not even that long. I'm being dramatic.
we did um, two years ago. I don't want to do it first. Uh, we are going through the Great Ocean Road, so it is a bit longer. We've made our first stop into Lawn. We're not quite into the town area yet, though. Great Ocean Road is the world's longest war memorial. We're here in Anglesey. It is one of our favourite towns on the Great Ocean Road. Mark Weens was just here having fish and chips about less than two months ago so we're gonna go to that fish and chip shop we usually go to one over there if you do ever come to Anglesey make sure you stop and have Jum's chicken their chips so yeah come with us yes When in Anglesey, coming on your way in or out, it is a must to stop at the chocolate factory, chocolatery, and have their ice cream. Honestly, I absolutely love their ice cream range. And it's just like a cute little place to come to. Um, they've got like their little chocolate factory inside and you can see how it's made and just cakes of cute little um, chocolates to to choose from we'll show you okay welcome to chocolate heaven if you haven't been to chocolate heaven this is it and if you want to see how chocolate is made in chocolate heaven this is where you go angle c chocolatery and ice creamery it also has a cafe um guys the chocolate there's over 250 types of different chocolates here different sizes different flavors to suit whatever your needs are like literally you will not be disappointed this is the cafe part uh, this is even more desserts that you can choose from an array of different desserts how good do they look how good do they look and then we have my favorite bit which is the ice cream guys i have to have an ice cream when prior to entering anglesey and when leaving in social tube 